Jack Charles. In 1780, he studied properties of gas and developed the law called Charles' law. Which states that at constant pressure, volume of a gas is directly proportional to its Kelvin temperature, or B directly proportional to T in Kelvin. Or B equal to K T, where K is constant. Or B by T equal to K, or constant. When temperature of the gas increases, its volume also increases. Here, initially at 20 degree Celsius, the volume of gas is 10 mm cube. When temperature increased to 29 degree Celsius, then volume increased to 10.3. When temperature increased to 42 degree Celsius, volume increased to 10.7. Here, by increasing temperature, volume of gas is going increasing. Let V1 is the volume of gas at temperature T1. Then V1 by T1 equal to constant. If temperature increases to T2, then volume becomes V2 or V2 by T2 equal to constant. From above equations, V1 by T1 equal to V2 by T2, which is called equation of Charles law. Here, by increasing temperature, volume of gas increases. The curve obtained between B and T is going increasing. At constant pressure here, the ratio to the volume and temperature of gas is constant. Application of Charles law. Hot air balloon is based on Charles law. Or hot air balloon rises in air due to Charles law. Bread and delicious gift based on Charles law. What volume of air will be expelled from vessels containing 400 ml at 7 degrees Celsius? when heated to 25 degrees Celsius at same pressure. The numerical problem related to Charles' law can be solved as a here V1 equal to 400 ml, T1 equal to 7 plus 273 equal to 280 Kelvin, T2 equal to 27 plus 273 equal to 300 Kelvin, and V2 equal to what? From Charles' law we know that V1 by T1 equal to V2 by T2 or V2 equal to V1 upon T1 into T2 which is equal to 400 upon 280 into 300 and the V2 will be 428.5 ml. Limitations of Charles Law Charles law is applicable to only ideal gases and Charles law holds good for real gases only at high temperature and low pressure. 